Under certain conditions, certain people have seen pink elephants and white rats. But believe me, there are far more grotesque and funny things to be found in the sea. This is the triggerfish. Did you ever see a more boob-faced creature? Outside politicians, of course. A black spot painted outside the tank keeps them puzzled and occupied for hours. Flat as pancakes and not nearly so nourishing are the moonfish. They average eight inches in length and half an inch in thickness. We're sorry for them, they've such a thin time. We don't know what this chap's occupation is, but it must be a sticky business. The Pacific flounder has two very noticeable characteristics, the absence of a nose and the side-by-side -side eyes. They work quite independently and can make a complete turn. Look like little birds nesting, don't they? Of course, they've got to keep their eyes skinned with such neighbours as this. By the way, a study of the octopus should play quite a part in the training of income tax collectors. Now we come to the versatile sea dragonfly. It swims and breathes like a fish, walks like an insect, has wings like a bird and looks like a nightmare. And that's not all. When he gets angry, he produces a sword from the back of his neck. One of his major problems is whether to swim or walk. But when the seabed's level, it's walk every time. 